Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm actually unboxing the Your Creative Studio box. Now I've done a few of these in the past so I will link the website that you can go check out this box in the description box below and I'll also link the other reviews that I've done as well. This one today looks like it's going to be all about traveling and tickets. Um, so I've had a little sneak peek already and it's got these beautiful papers at the top here and as you can see it's London and Paris um, and then I had a look further and there's these beautiful stickers and um, your creative studio actually creates um, a lot of the sticker designs so let's go through this box and I'll show you one by one in detail the first thing in this box is this beautiful bookmark and it says Paris I'll open it up so you can see what it looks like when it's actually put inside of a book but it's this beautiful gold it looks like metal but we'll soon find out so it actually feels a little bit like plastic, um, but it's got this rose on the bottom here. And then if I show you the front, oops, it looks like a little book. It's really cute, like Paris. Or a little stamp, it could be like a little um, stamp that goes on an envelope. I really like the design. So next we have this washi tape, and again, it looks like tickets. At the top it is called masking tape, um, so it might be a bit of a different texture. But let's open it up and I'll show you what the pattern is on the inside of this washi tape. Okay, so next we have, let's see what's inside of here, I have no idea. This is so cute. They're all different designs, like ticket stubs. Next is this super skinny washi tape and the design on this is like a very delicate pattern. I can't actually see exactly what it is. Let me put it on paper so I can show you in detail. So as you can see it's very thin and I don't have a lot of really thin washi tape so I really like that one. It's got a beautiful design on it as well. So this is really cool. I love this. It's like a bunch of tickets. I'm pretty sure it's the day, same design the whole way through, but I was really excited about this because um, I saved a lot of my train tickets when I was on the Shinkansen and I journaled with them. So when Dan and I went to Japan last year, we had to reserve a lot of tickets. Um, so yeah, I kept them all and seeing this again brought back a lot of memories. So this is really cool to journal with, um, especially if you haven't been to Japan, you can maybe put these in some spreads um, yourself so yeah I really like this idea I hope there's a stamp inside I love stamps Urgh, why is this not opening oh actually I should keep this adorable little box <gasps> it looks like a rubber stamp yes all right let's stamp it in my journal and we'll see how it comes out I think I might stamp this on top of some of my um, packages that I'm sending out from my shop. So this one is also a rubber stamp, so we'll check this one out as well. And it says Bus Services, New York Bus Company. So these are just um, pieces of paper. Oh, and there's lots of different designs. What's this one? Little report. Why are they all upside down? 
these are cool. They all look like basic, they all look like vintage papers out of different stores. So some of these could have been like medical centers, some of these could have been, what's this one, like finer foods, what's this one? dairy company so it's sort of like shops like what you'd use to either log your food or what's this one berry seed company like inventory and stock and stuff that's cool I really like these so I already showed you this one at the start, but this is a sticker sheet and your creative studio must have designed this one because it's got their little logo at the top and it's like a, lots of tickets. Next we have this very long and vibrant receipt book. Let's see if they're all pink inside. I remember my mum banking a lot of checks when I was younger. Oh, how times have changed. <laughs> Again, this would be really good in a vintage journal spread or also in like a vintage snail mail package. Love it. So again, this is more papers that look like receipts or things that you would find in stores to log either your stock or to write out checks or something like that. Um, it actually looks very similar to the stamp that we got because it's got CA on it and it's got all the lines. I think it's actually exactly the same as the stamp to be honest with you, um, but it's the paper version. Oops, I just accidentally stamped on there. But the front actually looks like a sketchbook. I really like the design on the front as well. So last we have more papers. And again, I think this is similar to the little one here, um, but different designs. And then again, lots of great papers to journal with um, or send in snail mail packages. So this is a really cool box to do some vintage journaling. Um, and all of these designs are really cool because I love collecting old papers. So these ones must have just been um, based on, like these could actually have been scanned in and printed a bunch of times, but they might've also been designed by an artist. Thanks for watching this video today. These are all the items in the box. I'll have the link in the description box below if you wanna go check out your Creative Studios website. And hopefully I'll do some more stationary unboxing videos for you in the future. Give this video a big thumbs up if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.